Today we're going to learn how to paint this painting in Italy. So what is the legend of Persian wine? All right, let's run through the colors. Queen red, pearly red, primary yellow, Indian yellow, Van Dyke brown, ultramarine blue, Quin blue, phthalo green, titanium white, Mars black. All right, for this painting, we've laid in kind of the sky really generically, really quick. Uh, the lighting sky, I think I'm getting that color a little bit better feel for how to get that color between the blue and the oranges. Um, it's kind of a light defined uh, thing, so we'll coat that in a couple times. I've added the house already. I don't know if that's kind of jumping the gun. We'll see. <laughs> if I have to redo the sky several times, it's going to be a waste of time. But, you know, it's nice to have that kind of reference points. We put in some of the rows. Um, I got to kind of the wrong kind of too much of a curve here which is okay if you want to do it unrealistically but I kind of want to have this a little bit more realistically so the, the rows are going to be like this if they were that sharp they probably wouldn't plant um, and then we're going to define those mountain ranges it's this really light blue I think in the photo they probably heightened up the blues maybe um, so I don't know if that's a realistic blue but it is a nice pulls in the sky and this together <laughs> dates to King Jabshid and one of his women of the um, harem were banished and as she was banishing she's like oh, I'm gonna poison that guy fuck that guy <laughs> and so what she did is she took this uh, foul grapes and she thought that would poison him so she gave it um, she drank some of this foul liquid and discovered it actually picked up her spirits because it was it turned to alcohol so she brought it to the king she was forgiven she brought back into the harem and the king jamshid pronounced all the wine in that area to be dedicated to winemaking so that's the question of the day all right just finished the painting let's take a closer look so we got this kind of neutral sky very clear sky and come on camera focus You bastard. All right, so we have kind of this neutral sky, blue, and then it goes into the yellows. Um, I think I worked that pretty well by using gray as the middle ground, so you don't get green in the sky. You got a little church there on top of the vineyards. Um, all the vineyards have the lines as well as all their leaves on still. I use kind of a darker red in the foreground, per se. 
overall I think it's a pretty good painting. Um, you know, the composition is pretty nice because you have all those rows pull up to the top of the hill and then you have the hill going around to the church. Obviously that's the focal point. I probably could have changed up the sky to make it more drama, but I think with the really high detail of the vineyards, you don't, you want kind of a calm area on top in the sky. So I think that works pretty well. Um, I think it's pretty good. Composition works. Um, yeah, the, the mountains are a little funky. They were that kind of color with the fog in the mountains, which you see a lot in vineyards areas where you have the fog crawling in at night and then you have um, the hot baking sun of the day. That's how you make really good wine is these really extremes in temperatures that's dry, occasionally wet, but not too wet, mostly dry. So that's kind of the ideal, the way wine country actually looks. And I live next to Napa, it looks like that. So hopefully you guys like it. Uh, if you want to subscribe, you can subscribe below. And if you want to see the long version of this video, I have that on Patreon now. Um, so go check that out. I think it's five bucks, I think, to watch that. Or um, if you're early, it's one dollar. So if you get the first one, you get only on for a dollar. Otherwise, it's five dollars. So hopefully you guys like it. Give me a thumbs up. If you want to subscribe, you can subscribe below. And I'll see you in the next painting video. Thanks for watching.